Hello there, I'm Ben Wade, and in this Unleashing tutorial, you are going to learn about WordPress plugins. This video is part of a series where you will learn how to build a website with WordPress. And those are all organized so they're easy for you to navigate at UnleashU.com. Now, let's dive into WordPress plugins. So the first thing you'll need to do is go ahead and log into your website. And you can do that by adding forward slash wp-login.php after your domain name. Then go ahead and log in with your username and password. And that'll bring you here to your dashboard. Now to really understand what plugins do for WordPress, you have to understand what WordPress does for a website. WordPress by itself acts like an operating system for a website, the same way an operating system on a computer manages your computer. Now the same way that you need to add programs and applications to your computer to allow it to do things that the operating system doesn't do, plugins allow you to add functionality to your website that don't come with the standard WordPress install. Now to get a good idea of what we're talking about here, let's go take a look at a few so you can understand what they do. We'll go to plugins and add new. And let's take a look at some of the recommended plugins. And these four plugins are a great example of what plugins do for WordPress. Yoast SEO does a lot of SEO work or search engine optimization work for your site. WordPress by itself doesn't necessarily do that. Yoast makes it very easy for you to do a lot of on-page optimization. Now WordFence Security is a good security plugin. And again, if you think of WordPress as an operating system, WordPress has some natural vulnerabilities that you need to fill in with a WordPress plugin. The same way that with a computer, you typically have to install some sort of malware or antivirus software. WooCommerce is a very popular e-commerce platform. WordPress by itself is not really set up to handle an e-commerce store, but if you install WooCommerce, that instantly makes it to where you can set up a storefront on your site. Contact Form 7 is a very popular contact form creator. WordPress by itself doesn't really handle contact forms, so all you have to do is install Contact Form 7, and that allows you to create contact forms. Now, WordPress by itself doesn't really handle any of these things, but as soon as you install one of these plugins, now your website has that capability. And that's what plugins do for WordPress. They add functionality to a website the same way programs and applications add functionality to a computer. And that's the nuts and bolts of what plugins are. In future tutorials, we'll show you how to install them, and then we'll have a bunch of tutorials that show you how to set up individual plugins. All right, in the rest of the tutorials in this series, you'll learn how to actually build a website with WordPress. Another series will be behind the scenes tutorials on how we created these videos. We'll cover how we built UnleashU.com, which is where we organize all of our tutorials so they're easy for you to navigate, and links to that are in the video description, so be sure to visit. Lots of great stuff coming up and you don't want to miss any of it. So be sure to click that like button on our Facebook page. Be sure to click that subscribe button on our YouTube channel. Basically follow us where you find us so you never miss a thing. Also like, favorite, comment on, and share this video so other people have an easier time finding it. Alright, thanks for watching and keep an eye out for more tutorials coming up.